Refreshing Stories Hi, I'm Hiroshi, the CEO of Ohira Security Corp. We've created a nationwide surveillance camera network for crime detection, prevention, and even seizing evidence of affairs. Since I have a truly happy marriage, there's no need to use that. Thankfully, our products are in high demand overseas, so we are on track to rise to global market share. The company is sailing smoothly, but there's one problem. Still working, Mr. Tsukamoto? Oh, hey, Mr. Ohira! Yes, I'm done with the presentation materials, but I want to brush up. That's a good thing, but you should go home. Your wife and newborn are waiting for you. Yes, but I need to work hard and earn, so... Uh... Mr. Tsukamoto, as a father, participate in housework and childcare. You guys need to work together. Oh, <laughs> that's true. I'm sorry. I'm gonna head home. Good grief. He's really brilliant, but when he focuses too much, he becomes narrow-minded. Many of my employees are workaholics, so I would like them to value their families more. Hey, listen! A man's job is to work! Leave all of the household to women, okay? Here's this guy in. All you need to do is shut up and listen to this future CEO, Sir Joji Kazamitori. I would get into the worst trouble because of this man named Kazamitori later on. I'm home, Sumugi! Welcome home! <sighs> I made some omelets. This is Tsumugi, my beloved wife who's currently pregnant. She works at a fashion-related company, and just started maternity leave. Delicious! Thanks as always. I'll come home early tomorrow, so I'll cook. You don't need to work hard just because you're on maternity leave. Okay, thanks. You look bummed. Actually, the art fashion project I proposed at the company was accepted. The one that was rejected a few times, right? Good for you. Thanks. But since I'm on maternity leave, my coworker will be in charge of it. Really? That's a waste. Oh wait, I'll take paternity leave for a year so you can return to work. What? You? You're a CEO though, that's impossible. I'm taking two weeks off after giving birth, so that's enough. Nope. Watch me get it. Japanese men taking paternity leave is low compared to other countries, right? It's strange because the company is globalizing. Hmm, well, if you say so then, I'll return to work and do my best. Okay, but just remember that your health is the number one priority. Tsumugi safely gave birth the next month. The baby was a girl, and we named it Iori. I then finished all of my work in preparation for my maternity leave. Everyone was surprised when I announced that I'd be leaving for a year, but they cooperated, so I could concentrate without worrying about anything. I'm leaving! Bye, Lori! And Hiroshi! Take it easy, okay? Okay, I'll be fine, so don't worry about it. See you, Tsumugi! I made a grand promise, but I didn't have time to spare. Diaper change, milk every three hours, bedtime, clean the bathtub, bathroom, room, do laundry, cook, and... Taking out the trash, refilling shampoo bottle, airing the futon, and countless others. It's also hard to go shopping while holding Iori. Okay, ATM, and then the post office. Oh, Iori, it's time to change your diapers. Mad Dad, so jealous. Maya, why are you so freaking slow? Can you hurry up? Can't believe you made me come here on my day off. Jeez. Um, I'm sorry. My precious time is being lost every second because of you dumbasses. Do you understand? I want a meal ASAP when I get home. I won't forgive you if you buy side dishes. At first, I was busy and exhausted, but I gradually got used to it and was now able to do it more efficiently. When my life was settled, I got an emergency call from my company one day. What? The server crashed? Yes. There's been a network server failure in the surveillance camera system. If a large backup server is not prepared within a few hours, the system will stop working and cause trouble for customers. Calm down. I thought something like this might happen. So I've been eyeing a large server in Taiwan for emergencies. Oh, it's on sale for 1 billion yen. Seriously? Oh, thank God. Since it's urgent, I'll pay from my account. Can you take care of the system failure? I informed Sumugi, had her leave work early, handed Iori, and ran to Skato Bank, Echo Branch. It takes a long time to transfer money overseas from this bank, so I had to transfer to another bank. Phew, I have enough time. The number tag, the number tag. Hey you, this is yours. Oh, thanks. I feel like I've seen him somewhere before. Anyways, 427. Customer number 77. Thank you so much for waiting. 77? My number's way ahead of that, but there's no one waiting, so I'll probably get called soon. Hopefully. However, no matter how long I waited, my number was never called. In fact, customers who came after me were escorted one by one, I'm usually patient, but since I've been waiting for about an hour, I had enough. Uh, excuse me, I've been waiting for an hour already. Yeah, and? Who cares about that? 
You're a scumbag who lives off of your wife anyways. Huh? What makes you think that way? Idiot. It's obvious that you're a jobless scumbag by looking at the dirty apron you're wearing. The hell is he talking about? I'm a stay-at-home dad now, and what's wrong with it? Pah! Men taking paternity leave is so outdated. Listen, paternity leave is for men who can't work. They're just lazy people. Same as trash, okay? Understood? I don't know what you're saying. You're the outdated one! Anyways, I'm in a hurry and don't have time to argue. Can you please let me withdraw money now? You better stop lying. Use the ATM or something, loser. I bet you can only withdraw 100 yen, though. <laughs> this isn't going anywhere. Please, call Manager Iwabuchi. He's someone who's friendly to me. Manager Iwabuchi definitely won't come here. Know your place, idiot! How dare you talk like that to this highly educated elite banker, Mr. Kazamitori! This guy wouldn't even escort me to the counter even if I explained the situation and kept on mocking me. But when I looked closer, I recognized him. I remember that last time when I came here wearing an expensive suit. He was on his knees the whole time and was sucking up to me! Hmm... So he's the kind of person who judges people based on their appearance. He kept on mocking me in front of everyone, and I couldn't stand it anymore. Hey, don't you have a wife and kid? I hope you're not making your wife do all the housework. Yes, I do. And make her do everything from housework to childcare. <laughs> What's wrong with that? What idiot would do housework if they're earning money for the family? Anyways, I'm busy, unlike you. So go withdraw 100 yen from that ATM and get the hell out of here! After saying that, he finally got up and disappeared somewhere else. Then I asked another banker to withdraw 1 billion yen from my account and transfer it to another bank. Additionally, I advanced 1 billion yen to Taiwan from my account. The purchase was safely completed and everything settled down. Oh, Hiroshi, how did it go? You look like you aged 10 years. Yeah, it was fine. Just in time though, thanks to the banker named Kazamitori. Kazamitori? Maya has the same last name. Maya? Your friend who came to our wedding? Yeah, her maiden name was Yamada, but she became Maya Kazumatori. I met her at the park today when I took Lori there, and she was complaining that her husband treats her like a servant. I feel so bad for her. Can you tell me more about that? I then went to Skato Bank again the next week to take care of something. Hello, how are you? Ah, you're that jobless loser from last week. Why the hell are you wearing a suit? Are you finally going to find a job or something? <laughs> hmm. I'm glad you remember my face, Mr. Kazamitori. I actually came here today to close my bank account. Wows! Good for us. I bet there's only a thousand yen in your account anyways. <laughs> Long time no see, Mr. Ohira. Hello, Manager Iwabuchi. Huh? Mr. Iwabuchi? He's just an uneducated loser who's on paternity leave now. Hey, you better shut your mouth. This person's the CEO of Ohira Security Corp. I'm so sorry for his rude behavior, Mr. Ohira. Please forgive me! No, no, I've experienced worse. Ha 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 may I ask what brings you here today? Oh, I came to withdraw my 10 billion yen deposit and cancel my bank account. I'm going to transfer. T 10 10 billion?! What?! Please, tell me why! We've had a good relationship for a long time, haven't we?! Yeah, but that's until last week. The reason is because of this guy here. I explained to him all of the humiliation I suffered because of Kazamitori. I just went to the bank in my apron since I'm on paternity leave, but was treated terribly. This is not just my problem. It's an insult to all the men and women out there who took paternity leave. Sharing housework and childcare to raise a child? What's wrong with not making sure my wife does all the work? Huh? Mr. Kazamitori? Uh, 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 I'm so sorry! You're right about this, Mr. Ohira! Mr. Kazamitori! What the heck is this about? You know they say men are dependable, right? I just thought it's pathetic for a man to wear an apron. And you thought that just because he was wearing an apron that he didn't have a jab? That's enough! How are you going to make up for this, you bastard? Huh? <laughs> I'm sorry, I, I didn't know that, that he was a CEO. I don't want to hear excuses. Can you withdraw 10 billion yen and close my account now, Mr. Kazamitori? But if I do that, my promotion will- Who cares? Can you get started? <laughs> yes, sir! I'll do it right now! I then made him withdraw, and I safely transferred it to another bank. I'm so sorry about everything. I will take full responsibility for deciding his punishment. Please don't let him serve customers anymore. Oh, Mr. Kazamitori, please receive punishment for disrespecting your wife and child, too. Well, you'll eventually know. Bye. Huh? What? What do you mean by that? Kazamitori was demoted to a rural area under the leadership of manager Iwabuchi. The client with 10 billion yen left, so it was a huge loss for the bank. In addition, several business owners who were at the bank that day also cancelled their accounts and switched to another one. 
they were disappointed with how he treated me just because I was wearing an apron. He was also abandoned by his wife and child. I heard all of the terrible things you did from Samugi. Making fun of Hiroshi being on paternity leave and being demoted? You're the stupid one here. Please wait! I don't know what to do if you abandon me too! I'm going to raise the child at my parents' house, so get the hell out of my sight. Bye! Tsumugi's friend Maya divorced him and went back to her parents' house. She's the daughter of a wealthy family, so she seems to be fine without him. It was worth having Tsumugi tell Maya about his abnormality in advance. Thanks to this incident, I received praise from my employees, and the rate of men taking paternity leave has increased significantly. And this led to us establishing a workflow that covered each other's work. I hope that someday, society as a whole would normalize men sharing in housework and childcare. Thank you for watching all the way till the end. Don't forget to subscribe and smash that like button. And if you have time, please check out our other videos as well. Alright then, see you next time. Bye!